these meteors and asteroids hit Earth. In 2016, a huge fireball lit up the Florida sky, shocking everyone who saw it. Look at that. Wow, burning up. It was captured on police dash cam footage. It was so shocking, people called police. Fireworks in the area. Scientists say the meteor entered the atmosphere at 40,000 miles per hour. It traveled right over downtown Tampa and possibly landed in the Gulf. To light up the nighttime sky, that's big. It's uh, you know as massive as a car, even more than that. So that's a big chunk of rock. That was nothing compared to the 10-ton meteor that hit Russia in 2013. Buildings shook, windows shattered, and nearly 1,000 people were hurt. In 2015, a driver in Thailand captured a giant meteor on dash cam video as it lit up the entire sky. In 2024, home surveillance camera in Europe caught a comet making an appearance. The European Space Agency shared video from camera in Spain near Portugal. The agency later said that the comet flew over the countries at 28 miles per second, before eventually evaporating over the Atlantic Ocean. In 2024, an asteroid entered the Earth's atmosphere and lit up the Philippines. The European Space Agency said it was just the ninth asteroid that humankind has ever spotted before impact. Thankfully, the one-meter space rock was harmless. In 2023, a meteor exploded in the night sky over Queensland, Australia, and landed in a remote area. In August of 2025, Dashcam caught a meteorite hurling to planet Earth, and it eventually crashed into a house in Georgia. It came straight through the ceiling and left a hole in the floor. Someone could have been very seriously hurt. Planetary geologist R. Scott Harris showed Allison Hall a piece of the meteorite after it disintegrated on impact. It actually went through the ceiling and into their living room. What, what happened? The homeowner was actually 14 feet away uh, at a home office desk had on, on noise canceling headset and uh, still heard like a very, very loud gunshot and then actually saw little bits of debris bouncing into the room where he was at. The meteorite was 4.56 billion years old, older than Earth itself. Finding a rock could be extremely difficult, the proverbial needle in a haystack. In 2023, the hunt was on for a large meteorite that crashed in the woods of northern Maine. Last Saturday on April 8th, there was a meteor that came through just north of Calais, Maine. It showed up on Doppler radar and with NASA. And there was also reports of a loud noise overhead. You know, as this thing's entering the atmosphere, it makes a loud noise. A museum offered a $25,000 bounty for the space rock. There are two types of meteorites when it comes to their discovery. There are finds, and that's one day I'm walking in the woods or in the desert or in Antarctica, and I just find this rock right here, and I, lo and behold, it's a meteorite. That's a find. I just found it. Where that's different, whereas you have a object you witness falling and landing on the surface, and we go over and we find it. That's a fall. I wish people uh, good luck in hunting. Be safe out there. Could a large asteroid hit the Earth? That's the premise of movies like Don't Look Up, Armageddon, and Deep Impact. Asteroids hit the Earth all the time. They mostly just burn up in the atmosphere. But NASA still takes asteroids seriously, and in 2022, the space agency launched the Double Asteroid Redirection Test Mission, or DART. It is the first of its kind to do this full-scale test of asteroid deflection on an asteroid of a size that we might be worried about in the future. It's really important to stay up front. The T is for test. These are not asteroids that are a threat to the Earth. We're doing this now to be ready before we need to. At the time, DART headed on a collision course with an asteroid named Amorphis, about 7 million miles away. Its mission was crashing into the asteroid with the goal of shifting it off course. The strategy is not to blow up the asteroid. All you want to do is give it a little tiny nudge, and that tiny nudge adds up to a big change in its future position with time. There are no known asteroids that are a cause for concern at this time. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Andrea Swindle.